morning. I see that. Oh, good <laughs> morning, Reverend. I brought your favorite blueberry scones. Thank you, Bree. By the way, I'm sorry I've taken so long to make a decision about the ladies' auxiliary. Oh, is that happening now? I'd forgotten all about it. <laughs> so is your uh, delightful neighbor coming, the one with all the questions? Delightful? <laughs> I thought she annoyed you. No, I found her refreshing. It's like I always say, church is not a place for answers. It's a place for questions. You don't say that. I've never heard you say that, not once. Yes, well, anyway, I want to thank you for taking the initiative. New members are crucial to the health of this church. I won't forget you brought them. Or these. Thank you, Reverend, and I'm, I'm sure the Scavos will be here soon. Why did you just say that? You know very well they went to Catholic Church. Which is just down the street. I'll be right back. the same of you. Why are you in a Catholic church? Because we're Catholic. Oh, please. Mowing your lawn in a Notre Dame sweatshirt doesn't make you Catholic. You're Presbyterian now. Come on, let's go. Weren't you the one who said I should explore other churches? I meant sample, like a buffet. You take a little bite of everything and then you sit down for the main course, which is across the street at the Presbyterian church. No, I just put 10 bucks in the collection plate and I'm gonna get my money's worth. Is there a problem? No, no problem. Just talking to my friend. She's trying to poach her. I am not. My friend's just a little confused. She forgot that she's Presbyterian and wandered into the wrong church. I'm not Presbyterian. I'm a free agent. And if you're open to a little Q&A, you've got me. Lynette, please. Can't we just go outside and talk for a moment? Okay. What gives? Well, I was at the service this morning, and it's just not the same without you. Bree. And I am up for the head of the ladies' auxiliary, and Reverend Sykes was so impressed that I brought a new family into church. So, if you don't come back, then... Oh, then you won't get what you want? Well, yes. Well, forget it. Let someone else help you with your power grab. Lynette! You were the one who came to me. You sought me out. Yes. And you know why? Because out of all my friends, you're the one who had real faith. You had an actual relationship with God. At least, that's what I thought. Lynette. Because I have had a rough few months. <laughs> okay? But I know you've had rough times too, and I always assumed that your faith had helped you get through them. I envied you that, to be honest. It did. It did help me. Really? Okay. How? It just did. Well, that's not a good answer. I have been through cancer and a tornado, and I don't know why I survived, and so many other people didn't. I don't understand. And I need to. Lynette, why didn't you tell me? Why didn't you ask? Well, that's right, you don't like asking questions. 